Hispanic Heritage Month, and we are bringing you inspiring stories from Latinos in our community. Today, we're going to meet a woman who stands out in her field as a developer with years of hard work and with dedication. She has a goal here, yeah. and she's hoping to inspire Latinas everywhere to follow their dreams, and she's going to help make that happen. NBC6's Kristen Sanchez here with how she is spreading this message. This is a good way here this morning. You're helping to spread that message for. Yeah, and let me tell you, she is so sweet. She is motivated and she really is inspiring so many women and people across the board who are just like her, maybe who can relate to her story. A daughter of Colombian immigrants. Stephanie is now the president of one of the largest development firms in Miami. It's a big accomplishment. And now she says that she's making sure that she inspires other women to stay true to who they are in the workplace. Every night I have to go to bed knowing that I inspired somebody. This is Stephanie Sojai. She stands out as one of the few female Hispanic property developers in the U.S. Stephanie helped catapult Shoma Group into great success from her position as a company chief marketing officer. But she tells me the journey to where she is now wasn't easy. I had to fight tooth and nail to get to where I am. Stephanie came to the U.S. as a young girl learning English at the age of eight. She says watching her parents, two Colombian immigrants, struggle to get ahead while learning a new language, it inspired her to break boundaries. I wanted to change the perception of the stereotypes of Latinos. Fast forward, I wanted to change the perception of women in the business place. She climbed her way to the top through her hard work and dedication while never sacrificing her passion for fashion. So now in these board meetings, I refuse to, to adapt to what the norm is. And it was definitely tough at first. People would not take me serious. I always say that I used to wear black to fit in, but now I will wear hot pink mini skirts. Now as the president of Shoma and with a huge following on social media of nearly half a million followers, her goal is to inspire women to be who they are and to help diversify the workspace. Forget the fact that we need more women in this in this company. We need to have, we are based in Miami after all. We need more Latinos and and I am a very large advocate for women empowerment so I wanted more Latinas. It's women like Liliana Amor, the current marketing manager of Shoma Group, who is thankful for the workspace Stephanie helps create. Sometimes you feel that you cannot be like fully who you are and she's like always super authentic and uh, inspiring to like all of us and it's always like looking out for like the growth of all the team. Let me tell you, I had so much fun interviewing both of them. The whole team is just absolutely fabulous and professional. Shoma Group may have helped create some locations that you already know, like Shoma Village, which is in Hialeah, or Shoma Bazaar, which is in Doral. Their most recent project will be Shoma Bay Condos, which is in North Bay Village.